Okay, let's do another while statement, a while loop, pardon me. And uh, let's do another while something is true. And let's do file. And the window. Oops, that window got way too big. Let me make that smaller. Like so. And like so. There we go. Now let's key in our code. I'm going to say that while the following is true, while this while the condition is true. Well, I haven't stipulated a condition. I just said while true. So this is going to keep going possibly forever if I'm not careful. So I can wind up in an endless, infinite loop if I make a mistake. So <laughs> if you use this method, don't make mistakes. X equals input. I'm going to say key in minimum uh, five characters or Q. Q to quit. Now, if X equal equal Q, then what do you... Oops, I forgot the colon. If X equals Q, then what do you do? Break. If the length of X is less than 5, colon, print out uh, more characters, please. More characters, please. And then continue. Otherwise, print out long enough. And that's it. That's my program. So as soon as it's As soon as I key in the letter Q, my program's going to break out of this while loop. All right. That looks good. Let's save this program. File. Save as. And uh, I'll call this um, while true. While true. Cares. Dot .py because I'm keying in characters now I'm doing string evaluation that's a good reason for that name I think so uh, let's run the program now run and run module oh and we get a prompt key in minimum five characters or Q all right let's key in oh you know I didn't put a space here so whatever I key in is going to be Put up again, put it up against that Q. That's ugly. I will fix that in a minute. So I'm going to key in A S D F. That's four characters. What? More characters, please. Key in minimum five characters or Q. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's eight characters. Long enough. Key in minimum five characters or Q. I'll key in A. One character. More characters, please. Huh. I'm going to key in the letter Q. And bingo, my program ends. Oh my goodness, that was that was fun. All right, let's go back over here and let's take that Q, put a colon there, and a space. And I'll make it uh, aesthetically more pleasing. Now, file, save, and so you can see that that was file and save. Now let's run this again. Run, run module. Again, minimum five characters. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Long enough. Again, five characters. A is DF. That's four. More characters, please. A. More characters, please. Okay. All is well. Let's key in the... Notice the space now that exists between the prompt and what I key in, what the user keys in. Yes? Okay. Let's key in the letter Q. And we're done. Amazing. So, this is, uh, that's all I have to say for now.
This is George Wall saying bye-bye.